Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. If you are looking for a job, you can log on to interview.com and you can post your resume with us. In this video, I'm going to talk about very basic Java interview question. What is a Java compiler? The Java compiler is an is an exe which is used to convert your Java code into the into byte code. Let's see the steps. First step is to write your Java code and save it as a dot Java file. For example, employee dot Java. The compiler takes your employee dot Java file, the demo file, and compiles it into a employee dot class file. You might be you might be asking what is the content of employee dot class file? All the dot class file will have the Java bytecode. That is the instruction for the JVM. Please remember, bytecode means it is an instruction for the JVM. The interpreter will help you your program to run. The JVM or the interpreter takes your employee dot class, which is the output of the compi compilation, and th it interprets it. JVM can understand bytecode and it executes on the operating system. The Java C command, there is a command Java C command compiles the Java source code into byte codes java byte codes and one more important responsibility of compiler is compiler checks for errors and won't let you compile successfully until all the compiler errors are resolved there may be syntax error there may be some some uh, logical errors and if you are not adapting whatever the java language is so it will give you errors related to java language and this is an example you can compile like this so this is your java c command that is an exe actually speaking it's an exe and you can give your class name I just want to give one more picture so you have a source file say employee.java file whenever it goes through the compiler compiler what it does is it is creating java byte code so compiler will create the java byte code and the compiler check for errors and it will not allow to compile successfully until all the all the syntax errors and are not resolved okay so once the compilation is done successfully there are no syntax errors the compiler will generate byte code so this byte code will be an instruction will become the instruction for the jvm so each operating system will have their specific jvm so so this byte code will be common for all the jvms so for example windows will have their specific jvm linux will have their own specific jvm and this byte code will become common to these two platforms that's how we are able to achieve platform independence so this is the purpose of java compiler hope this video is useful thank you and all the best